Cardio Mary Bro 101 here, and we're gonna do the way. Um, basically, this is an RPG Maker game, and if RPG, and if you don't know what RPG Maker is, just Google it, and there should be like a little info thing. Basically, what this is, so basically, this is a person who made this game. Like you know, one, I don't know. Um, so yeah, there's six episodes in this game. I did a little bit of research, but other than that, this is pretty much. Pretty much a uh, blind me. I did like a little bit because I needed to fix the font. So, yeah, the font isn't what it looks like now. You start out with a shitty, very like blocky J and all these other things. But I don't know with the introductions. Let's get this started. I'm completely blind to this, so if I suck, please give me tips. Episode one, version 2.0, last update, 6 2 Six, play game normally, no puzzles, no puzzles, no battles or puzzles. Play game normally. Plunge normal? Yes, sure. Luke Howell. Oh, I don't even know how to pronounce this. Face sets. Wanderers. All who exist are wanderers. Thus it has been since the dawning hour. There's our main character, standing on that rock. I don't have no clue how to pronounce that. I, I was- I don't know how, what his voice would be. Chris Vaughn Studios! All credit goes to them. I guess. I don't know. I don't know copyright. Um, probably presents. Something I possess little of. Don't say that, Rue. I don't have no clue. Trust the purpose. I'm sure that you, you and she are destined to meet again. The purpose. And it has betrayed me. Betrayal? I think not. Something that doesn't exist is incapable of betrayal. I can feel its call. You're just young. Where am I going? Well, where's Rue going? I need to rest. No. I can't rest any longer, apparently, is what Rue says. She must be further along the way. Da da da. Blue scarves? Those murdering bandits are somewhere nearby. Don't get taken by surprise. May the purpose guide me. Or me and Rue. Cause I'm his katana secretly. I'm secretly his little sword. That that boy scares me is what she said. He's not dangerous. Just confused. Oh well, it doesn't really matter. 
and he will be seeing the likes of him again. He is setting quite a pace for himself. Maybe he'll become a forerunner. No, he'll be dead. That'd be right. He seems like just like the type. Them forerunners are a crazy lot. I have no clue what a forerunner is. I don't know about you two, but I'm heading turning in for the night. Yes, it is getting quite late. They're gonna go sleep. But later that night. Wait. But later that night, when the fire is gone, something rustles in the woods. A shadow, perhaps, with an assassin with a knife. Dun, 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 dun. Secretly stalking, creeping up for his prey, and death. Daybreak at last. That's where we're gonna set our character. How you move is the arrow to you. Uh, X. I love you to do all this. That's what this is. Stats. One stats. And no clue what this does. No clue what this does. Yeah. No clue what any of that does. So, I'm sorry if I'm rude. Hey, Wonder, the purpose joins our way. I am Theron of the Nailed Stretch. I am Rue of the Blendered Stretch. Blendered, I see. You're up a little early today, my friend. I've been up since long before the first light. Really, is there trouble behind you? No, I'm just trying to make good progress. Why are you headed in such a hurry? I'm not sure. Well then, would you be interested in taking a few passes? I need some practice. What? What are you talking about? I'm talking about the plunge. Have you ever taken it before? I haven't. Ever. I've been a, I've been busy with other things. Well, I guess I could teach you a few things if you got the time. Just the bare essentials, of course. Sure. All right. Sounds more like it may be worth a while. Great. Now just stand where you are. There are three basic attacks in the plunge: the cross sweep, the lunge cut, and the drop slap. Both of you. Both of you and your both you and your opponent will use one of these attacks during the plunge. Each of them is strong against one one of the other's attacks and weak against the other. A cross sweep works well against a lunge cut. A lunge cut works well against a drop slash. And a drop slash works well against a cross sweep. However, just because you you use a better attack doesn't mean you'll deal more damage to your opponent than they deal to you. Choosing the right attack only helps to give your attack more on the wall. The damage you deal is largely dependent on your plunge speed. I won't go into all attributes involved in the plunge, but I can tell you, just looking at you, that your skill level is close to me. However, let's talk about HP real The picture below you is called your life speed. There are three attributes for you. Hit points, HP, plunge, plunge skill, PL, and damage threshold. DT. The oval under each of these letters represents the condition of each of these changes. During combat, the oval will change color in response to the changes that occur in these attributes. The meanings of the color in these as follows. Blue, superb. Green, excellent. Light green, fair. Yellow, failing. Orange, dying. Red, imminent death. If any of the ovals turn red, it means that you are probably going to be defeated. In other words, if you are, you are going to die in the plunge, if the plunge is defeated. That's one of the reasons we, why we call it the life cycle. During the plunge, you can check both of your life cycle, that of your opponent, between passes. I've left a lot un unexplained, and I'm sure someone will be kind enough to give you some furniture. More advanced plunge concepts include critical hits, blade arts, risk attack, attack links, finishers, and such. Once you learn about those things, you'll be able to develop your own special balance. But enough chat. Let's do this. Launch um, cut! Oh, Jesus. Oh, no! Uh, yeah! Nine. Injury. Three. Are you sure this is your first time? I'm pretty sure. Drop slash! Yeah!
stronger than me. Do I have a chance to win? Cross sweep! Breed of rat. It would have been really nice to have one of those. Maybe if I can catch it. How hard could it be? Now we're gonna walk all the way over here. Here's the save point. Record journey. I'm gonna go to like. That's the case. I'm gonna go to the next save point. So let's continue this recording session. I'm gonna go to the I'm gonna go to the next one until I'm done. There it is! My father once told me that Brett Swiftfoot's might have horrible eyesight, but great ear. As long as he doesn't see any signs of motions or hear any odd sounds, I might I'll be able to sneak up and grab him. It's still going to be tough though. Look at all those leaves on the ground just waiting to crack under my boots. Plus Swiftfoot's had a wide field of vision of about 180 degrees. And if he's looking left, he can see. So if he's looking down, he can see. Go for rabbit, check line of sight again, skip minigame. Go for rabbit! This is the most annoying minigame I've tried so far. Piece of crap! Piece of crap! See, this is so hard. I, I, I'm not, I don't have the patience for this. Crap. I don't have the patience for this. As I said again, this is it's too much patience. Crap. Um, thank you. Gotcha. Got him. one to boys this little rabbit is going to help me so much get some better some much better equipment once I get to the next settlement looks like a male I wonder what I should call him why not call him lucky who's there hey well, I am save it wonder what are you interested in selling that red squid to me no, he's not for sale. Good, good. Good. Yes, because I'm not interested in buying it. Blood. K.O. Thanks for the wet swift bit. I'm not the patient type, so you can imagine how hard it is for me to catch it. So am I! I'm probably, I'm probably doing you a favor by taking this little guy off the pants. A little runt like you would get hurt. Oh, wait. You already got hurt. 
climate suit. Why don't you contemplate what's just taking place here while I go make some money in the races? Later, blue boy. Will he be alright? Or... Yes, I believe so. Looks like he's coming around. I don't know who's supposed to voice that. How are you feeling? Very tired. I patched you up as best as I could. Dana is a member. Mender. A mender? Yes, a mender. I draw power from blood life and refocus it in order to mend wounds. There was a good amount of blood on the ground when we got here, so that made things easy. You draw power from people's blood? I draw power from an element in the blood called life, uh, called blood life. Oh. I never heard of such a thing. Demon magic! Wes hadn't heard of it either when we first met. I didn't believe it at first, but I came around rather quickly. Well, I'm not bleeding, so there must be some truth in what you say. So I guess you got jumped by bandits, huh? Mm, yeah. Looks like it's going to rain. We better get a move on. We should be near the cellar if I, if I was told right in, in the last place we visited. Good. We better hurry, though. Do you want to come with us? Yeah. I think I will. Um, yeah? Whoa. Hours later. The settlement can't be too much. Let's hurry before it gets any worse now. Screw it! I'm going further. What's that down there? What the? Whoa! Spiked flyers! Preemptive attack! Looks like you stumbled upon some spiked flyers, Rude. Should we run? Oh, there's only two of them, and their spikes fetch a fair price in the settlements. I've never been in a fight like this before, Rude. A few, but why do you ask? I was just thinking that might explain the ideal time for me to explain the x life system. You do, as you know, Dana draws power from blood life. But there's all other sources of power. There are other sources of power as well. We generally call these the power gate of all of these sources X life. I can tell by looking at your sword and the ability to draw X life naturally in combat situ situations. Your sword will add plus one to your XL automatically every turn. You should, you should be able to eventually level up that sword until, until it's able to draw two, three, or maybe four XL per turn. You could also use your turn in combat to concentrate on drawing in more XL. For example, if you have the technique called Draw, using will add plus one to air XL. After you have acquired enough XL, you'll be able to perform a variety of other techniques that will release the pool power. The technique you can also draw is Spin Blade, which costs four XL. It deals damage to all enemies. Your allies in combat store and use XL in the same manner. That's enough information. Let's fight! Three damage. Actually, let's do two attacks. Six HP is lost. It causes attack power to increase. I'm 
jump up or anything. Well, actually, I think we're gonna end it off here due to that nice little tutorial, but this might, that might actually get to So this is a Mary Bar 101, and this is the first recording session of The Way, episode 9. And I say good day, and in the next episode, we're gonna talk about how I'm gonna do it. So I say good day.